Good morning. It's Saturday morning. It's miserable outside. And I have loads to do, so I'm going to take you with me. Um, I've got a lot of those, like, how are you? What's going on? Questions. And I am going to do a sit down video, but I'm not going to do it yet because I just had a CT this week and I don't have the results yet. So I feel like I don't really have any update. Um, I am on cycle two of Kiskali. Um, yeah, I'll talk all about like how I'm coping with that, but mornings are okay at the moment. Afternoons, I'm so tired, so we gotta get this done. So today is gonna be a vloggy type video. Um, I'm gonna take you with me and um, yeah, we'll just get done. So for context for what is about to happen, I have a new piece of furniture, which is there, which I'm gonna move somewhere over there. And it's to hold what's in here, which is the Christmas tree. Um, and that was fine, but the thing is that it's become like a dumping ground. Basically at the moment, there's all bags with Paw Patrol toys in them, um, which need to go to a new home. But then, like literally anything where if someone doesn't know where it goes, it, it goes into that corner and I can't be looking at it. I cannot, I can't stand the look of clutter. So that's what's happening now. I'm trying to declutter places and um, sort it out. So if you're thinking, what is going on with her house and that furniture that's in the middle of the floor, that's what it is. thinking oh I'm feeling okay actually and then I realized I forgot to take my Kiskali so I've just taken that oops I don't usually forget but um because when I go to work in the morning like one of the last things I do before I leave the house is I take my Kiskali which is why I always feel sick in the car um I should probably rethink that but that's what I do um floor is filthy over here so anyway look we're in the corner the corner 
of doom. Um, so yeah, as I said, it's just like become a dumping ground. Um, so, right. Let's discuss. Let's move this out of the way. So the kids have, this was the kids art corner. So they have all like sensory toys and stuff here. This is all of their art bits and pieces. And then they've got like a little trolley with clay and arty bits and whatever. Um, so in behind here is where I hide my Christmas tree and my decorations because I don't have an attic and I live in an apartment. So like storage is an issue. Um, and then also Ashton's getting rid of his um, Paw Patrol toys. Now, Ashton has been getting rid of his Paw Patrol toys, like as in they have been sitting in one place or another since June. Now I'm giving the toys away, but um, basically like uh, some of the girls that I work with have little kids that are in work and um, I was like, well, they can have first dibs on whatever they want and then um, I don't know why I'm telling you all of this, but anyway, and then we'll just use the rest and work. So I'm finally gonna get rid of the Paw Patrol stuff. Then I have like a bread bin there that I just didn't want to throw in my bin and I need to get rid of that. And then um, there's the, the drawers out of the fridge. And so I took them out because I find that when I put veggies into the drawers or whatever, I forget that the stuff is there or stuff goes on top of it and then the vegetables go off or like cheese will go moldy or something like that. So um, it just makes more sense to have no drawers and extra space so you can see everything and whatever. And that way I eat everything in sight. <laughs> so yes, this is what we're doing now. <laughs> I've started I can't stop now though I hate when you get to this point where you're like oh my god what did I get myself into I'm like I can't leave it now anyway okay we continue now So the last of it is now just this um, Halloween, Halloween stuff. Uh, the boys have taken all of the Paw Patrol stuff to the car for me, so hooray, I don't have to do that. Um, so I'm making lunch for the guys and then I need to go down to the toy shop because tomorrow is Ashton's birthday party and um, we're doing like old school party games like um, pass the parcel and musical statues and stuff like that and you win a prize so it's only a couple of them coming over the boys are like that they just like a small little party with a few of their friends um, 
So yes, that's what I will be doing after I make lunch. Oh, I don't really, I don't want to leave the house. I, I have this like thing that comes up now and again where I just have that like social anxiety where I don't want to, I don't want to see anybody. Um, so now I'm like, I really don't want to go, but <laughs> like it's only going to take a few minutes, but I don't know why I get myself so worked up over it. Okay, boys, your lunch is ready. Okay. You can tell. I can't even. I like a, look like a hobo. Can't even. I can't show you. I can't show you. Anyway, but um, I'm going to go. Um, I can do it. Okay. I made it. Right, you just did there. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't, don't feel great now. So I think I need to be finished. So just a small little update before I end the video, which by the way, I'm so sorry if you're like bored out of your mind, but just you know the way I say like I don't have anything to film so just decided I'll take you with me for my morning um update wise so I'm on cycle two of Kiskali um my mid-cycle bloods were um like neutropenic um and I did then I was catching like so many things which was like really annoying um but anyway I um I had a CT sorry I'm finding it so hard to think straight and talk right now because like I'm not feeling good and normally I wouldn't I wouldn't make a video when I feel like this <sighs> okay so I had a CT done this week on Tuesday and today is Saturday and there was still no report yesterday so I don't know what the results are um I I'm trying as hard as I can to put it out of my mind so just now and then um I wonder about it I wouldn't say it's like I don't have anxiety really about it because I'm able to just put it out of my mind at this stage um before I had the scan, I did have a scan anxiety because I had that thing of, you know, oh, what if and uh, whatever. But for me, like the scan was done and then it's like, it's out of my hands. I can't do anything about it. So you just have to wait. Um, so I suppose when I am thinking about it, I'm wondering, um, like, are they going to see that it's spread somewhere else? Are they going to see like shrinkage like what are I have no idea what to expect I don't know um I that's my tummy um I kind of am hoping that um it's like no change or something like that that or that it looks better excuse me um because if there is more growth that's definitely going to be more frightening then I think oh I won't have as much time left as I maybe thought I might um so I suppose that's like the scary part you know um but yeah it's just a waiting game so yeah so that's it that's the that's the only update I have it's not much um obviously like once I get the results then I can make like a sit down video and talk about it a bit more and like talk about the things that have been going through my mind and whatever um but right now there isn't really anything to say like genuinely I don't even I don't have this anxiety because I I don't have the energy to <laughs> to be honest the energy to be worrying um 
Anyway, I have a headache now. I feel sick. I'm making out like Cascali is kicking my ass all of the time. It's not. Um, normally, when I take it before I go to work, like, I'm really, like, I'm constantly busy in work and distracted. So the only thing I would ever notice would be the nausea. Um... Um, and then when the afternoon comes, I am floored. I am so tired in the afternoons now. Um, I've got the old fatigue, I suppose. Yeah, I'm rambling. I am rambling. I need to stop. Okay, sorry, this was a boring video. I'll try and make the next one a bit more interesting. Okay. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.